Well, I'm very pleased to be here to present personally an award to Andrew. I went and attended the release of the short film that Andrew was part of uh, being part of creating. And I had just come from talking about well-being and how a big part of well-being is how connected you are to your community. And we talked about social connectivity and physical connectivity. And I learned a big lesson about connectivity from Andrew and the film. And so it's my honor to, to present him with a Mayor's Award today. Well, it's my real pleasure to be here this morning um, to present Andrew a 2014 Mayor's Award and for your work with Bridges Beyond Barriers. So thank you. That's great. I am very glad to share my life with my fellow citizens. Wealth has been my home since I was eight months old. But for years I had to commute to programs and other places because of my severe autism. Since 1997, I have lived in my own Guelph home supported by my family and friends. I have a good life that revolves around me. For the first five years in my home I was finding my way. The biggest factor in my adult life has been using supported typing to make decisions. I love words and learning. I started composing poetry in 2002 and also try to paint the images in my mind. I have published some books and articles. We worked on my health and developed creative ways to sustain my good life. My trained service dogs keep me company. I am passionate about caring for the environment. I love to run and am proud to be a Guelph Victor encouraged by some fine running friends. Once I felt secure, I wanted to reach out to others. We have shared my experience about growing into my home with other families and circles of friends. From early 2004 I invited other adults who cannot speak with their voices to meet in Guelph. We call ourselves Bridges Over Barriers. We are good friends and wonderful teachers who have a lot to say and try our best to be heard. Our gatherings provide respectful space for true expression of our feelings and open, honest communication. We published a documentary film and book in 2010, in our own words. The filmmaker who worked with us was inspired to propose a short dramatic film based on our words and insights. Holding in the Storm, My Life with Autism was launched in March 2014. I hope the movie helps people understand what an autistic person might be feeling. I hope it leads to great discussion among neurotypical as well as autistic people. My Life is a success story. The point is that people listen and collaborate with me and I am doing so much with my life. I think my life has meaning because all that I do matters to me. I want people to know that we need meaningful things to do in our lives that we choose and are not chosen by others. 